Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving if you're having slow LAN Ethernet speed on your Windows 11 laptop or computer. So if you notice your internet is very slow over the LAN connection, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the start menu. Type in CMD, best result, check a back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now into this elevated command line window, we're going to type in a couple of different commands here. So the first one is going to be IP config space forward slash flush DNS. Flush DNS should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter the keyboard. Should come back with successfully flush the DNS resolver cache. Next command you want to type in is NETSH space WinSock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K space reset. Again, exactly how it appears on my screen here. Hit enter the keyboard. It should say that you must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. So what I recommend doing at this point would be to close out of here and restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that would have been able to resolve the problem. If you are still having an issue here, guys, something else you can try would be just to reset your network settings back to default. So in order to do that, open up the search, type in settings, go, go ahead and open up settings. And you want to select the menu icon up at the top, and then you want to select network and internet. Go ahead and left click on that. On the right side here, go down and select Advanced Network Settings. Go ahead and select that. And then on the right side, underneath More Settings, select Network Reset. Reset all network adapters to factory settings. And then it says that this will remove. And then reinstall all your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. Go ahead and select the Reset Now button. Are you sure you want to reset your network settings? Go ahead and select yes. Once you've done that, close out of here and restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that should have been able to resolve your problem. And as always, thanks for watching. Do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.